And what is going on, my beautiful people? Snack here. This time, we're bringing you an enchanting RPG life sim, which let us embark in a journey in brave, voracious creatures in an immersive medieval fantasy world. What I am truly excited about this game is that, as a Stardew Valley fan, I also like to have more combat in the game, and this just hits the spot. There's farming, socializing, and more combat into it. It's almost like Souls-like because you can dodge, you can parry, you can roll, which is pretty awesome in a farming life sim. So, uh, well, let's go ahead and check it out. Oh, it just looks like everything is in ruins. We are, we've are we been attacked by some sort. It could be a dragon, a bandit, or uh, it could be because of war. Because of war, you guys. All right, here we are. Our name uh, should be automatically Snack. And I've been thinking, I've actually checked it out, but I will go ahead with Kill Seer because I love to start farming and those kind of things. There's also Tureen. You're kind of a noble. You are assertive. Uh, Os Osora, you're a craftsman. Uh, for people who loves crafting, you are curious, like a tinker. Uh, Seer, uh, oh, home for the elves. This is a mysterious island. Uh, you are consentious. You're kind of careful and uh, cautious and things, maybe. And Valera, uh, home for the solitary woodland loving people. Ah, this is interesting. You are introverted. <laughs> and well, we'll go ahead with this. And because uh, I love farming with combat, of course. Okay, now uh, we need to choose our social class. Okay. A uh, royal noble peasant, a royal, a life of extravagance and luxury can quickly become one of pressure and protest as you regrettably discovered. Ah, okay. Peasant. I'm a peasant at heart. <laughs> I'm just a nobody. So if you're a royal, you're socially alluring, your gear degrades faster. Okay, maybe you don't have time to, or the skills to maintain your gear. Uh, a noble uh, dances, fine wines, foods, and friends. Nothing could uh, darken your day save for an unhappy brush with the peasantry on you clothing is more potent okay your crops grow more slowly okay you have more time spending on your clothes than growing your crops so uh not not me not me so the peasant higher society had little concept of or core for your work <laughs> this is me at the moment man and so they remained ignorant to your importance for now oh this is uh, this is cool energy is less of a worry for you i like this one is the more energy you have in game the more you can do and uh, make out the best of the game and you are socially unpolished the problem is we're socially unpolished so we might need to learn some few skills to you know to keep us uh going forward so uh we are a peasant okay choose your background herbalist tinkerer farmer actor criminal fighter rat cat sure this is this is weird. <laughs> uh, nobody notices a rat catcher. Oh, it's like an exterminator. Okay. And then a farmer. All right. You can you can pause this one, guys. And you can just read out this one. Herbalist. Uh, tinkerer. Farmer. Actor. Criminal. Fighter. And lastly, rat catcher. And I, I am a farmer at heart. And uh, yeah, we are done. We are uh, we are at the Kilsir land of origin. A peasant and a farmer at heart. Let's go, you guys. Okay, at the upper left, we need to escape to the docks. Maybe, hopefully, we could survive this unfortunate events. So uh, also, I played a bit of the game. And I love the controls, although I'm not the fa a fan of the art style. But I learned to love it because it's just more immersive this way. It's like you're reading, uh, uh, how do you call that? If there's, I know, I only know comics, man, but I've, I've, I know the children's books. It is the same art style as this, but this one looks grimmier, darker, and more immersive, and uh, it really hooked me up. So here we are, us. I must attend to your mother. Oh, this is our father. Oh, my heart is relieved to see you unharmed. But do not linger for our sakes. Raiders still prowl the shadows, and their numbers may swell at any moment. Oh, we were attacked by raiders, that's why. We shall share words again, I promise you. Now haste, make for safety. Oh, uh, Pop, I could carry ma'am. There's three of us here. How could? How come we couldn't carry ma'am to mom together? Like, all oh, three a huge men. We can do this. Ah, oh, you are here. Seeing you brings me comfort. We were scattered when the attack came. I fear, I fear the worst. Usher spears downwards. Mother is unfortunate to be alive. Is fortunate to be alive. Yet her legs are badly hurt. Shall we? Shall be okay. She shall be okay. Already ordering us around. Nonetheless, she needs help. We cannot provide here. I need coffee, you guys. <laughs> he locks eyes with you. There's a ship in the harbor. 
If it hasn't sailed yet, you must be on it. I do not suspect the path there will be clear. Father and I will manage here and follow when we can. Go now. Seek out a safer place. It could be important for all of our sakes. Yes, to continue the bloodline, you guys. Hopefully you guys will survive. Uh, man, it breaks my heart, but I have to run away. Uh, before we go, uh, maybe we there's something that we could check out in our house before it totally burns down. And also, I, I played a little bit of the game, and uh, what I'm really excited about is that... Uh, let me just uh, go ahead and read this. Spend the day cleaning up old Miller's shelter with mother and father. Hard to believe it's the same place where we used to catch fireflies and stare up the stars as children. We had a good laugh over those old stories. It's funny how those days seem both a lifetime ago and just yesterday. Here's to more laughs and good memories. Oh, that's that's sweet. But uh, you know what happened now? It's it's we have to survive this first. Ah, we saw a there's some cloth here, nice and a rusty copper sword. Okay, at least we are no longer cold. We also have an apple and a uh, health. Elixir, we need this because there, there might be some uh, raiders up ahead. Uh, we also have this a family heirloom. Oh, it's a picture of us. Oh man, I will miss my family for a long time. Hopefully, we could come back if we're able to survive this this menace. Okay, let's test out. Uh, yeah, but what I said earlier is that uh, the decision making of this game is uh, totally great because I, I am a fan of Frost punk if you have checked out that a city builder the decision making of that game is just it's like you are the director of the movie or it really gets into your bones and it in a good way but in a depressing way but it's good because it feels like you are really the one making decisions and uh, all the people around you are affected by it so anyway so this is the this is the attack we can also do a heavy swing uh, we can step back Oh, look at that lighting, you guys. Look at this lighting. Awesome, huh? And then there's also a roll. It's almost like Souls-like. All right, see you guys. Hopefully you'll survive. Okay, we have an old chest here. Ah, we have a better armor. Syrian Brigandine. Mm -hmm, this is way better. We also have a rusty iron sword. So we've upgraded, guys. We've upgraded. I think I am, I am ready to defend myself. I am more confident now. I should be able to survive. We also found a bucket helmet. This is the ultimate armor of all time. Bucket helmet. I think we're going to be overpowered with this, guys. And uh, let's see who is uh, beyond. Oh, oh, oh this, there's a bridge. Oh, hey, hold on. There's a raider. Okay. Uh, oh, oh, hold on. Okay. Look at this. Uh, let me test. Ah, uh, nice. I like it. Uh, the combat is fluid. The co it, it may not look that way, but you know, the combat is fluid. If you're the one who's actually uh, pressing the buttons here, it just feels so natural. <laughs> it was just really, it, it was, it just, it surprised me. This is good. This is good, you guys. I'm telling you. Okay, we can uh, press X to unequip. And I wish in the demo there is a controller support, but there should be in the full game. It would be uh, better for me because I, I hate sitting uh, long in the piece uh, on my, in front of my PC and uh, my shoulder hurts, my finger hurts because of mushing the right mouse too much. Okay, what do we have, what do we have here? Guys, you were just sitting here. There was an enemy by the bridge. What happened here? A deserter's fate. You came upon a group of guards, weary and disheveled. They explain that the bond bound a man, Thorn, abandoned his post at the village bridge during the raid, leaving, leaving it unguarded. Oh, this is not good. Thorn admits to leaving his post, not out of fear, but to intercept a rogue a group aiming to poison the village's water supply. His absence allowed the attackers and hindered access to the village resulting in a significant loss of life this is what i'm talking about you guys the decision making you need to leave the matter to them free thorn kill thorn yourself so as a mature person at least my mom told me so um let's see so first i'm a peasant i'm a farmer i am not a soldier i am not well equipped with the knowledge and skills to decide for this guy's faith. However, I am a merciful person and I value life. Normally, good people will leave the matter alone. A loving, merciful person will free Thorn. And if you go down here, that's a psychotic person, but I am here. I'm gonna free Thorn. Let's see what's gonna happen. All right. Oh, just leave. I won't. Oh, what? 
the no no way hey we're friends oh okay this is what happened they just attacked us that way hey how about you you're not fighting huh all right all right you are doing the good thing you you you, you dude don't fight me or i'll be forced to defend myself and thorn okay okay thorn i give you another chance please make it up okay don't do the same mistake again be happy even though it's very dark at this moment but be thankful be happy of all circumstances praise the lord thank the lord and everything as per the bible says we also have here rusted nasal helm uh we have another oh a heavy raider up 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 step back a little step back aha we got him we got him guys there you go and a roll and a roll at the back and oh, another roll all right and then ooh, we got this guy haha <laughs> he is down ah what do we have here we have a skill a melee archery farming trades charisma survival oh there is survival i i did not know that there's also survival aspect in the game so basically all the games that i all the game generous that i i love is in here farming combat socializing charisma uh trades and survival what more could you ask let's see uh nothing here nothing here nada uh no no nothing here oh man look at this the, the fire just looks so cool like it's so pretty although it's burning the house but you know the i'm talking about the art style the animation oh well something just exploded all right uh where is that ship where is that ship uh this is a dead end ah okay we're gonna go up you can typically free from enemy encounters we have a soldier here all right let's go i just killed your friend because he attacked me when i tried to free thorn the consequence is that i was able to free thorn but i i, I took one life away but it was his choice he just attacked me right away without any any word but uh, I, sh I should have i should have expected that right because they're soldiers they are trained that way or we could, we could also uh shift hold shift to sprint okay but if i but if i've actually i uh, just uh, let uh left the situation alone they could have three of them could have lived right i'm not i'm not sure but uh well you know it's a decision that we've made already we'll just have to live by it and learn from it so we are here at the dock and oh there's the ship here oh these places are pretty i can imagine myself fishing here listening to good music drinking my coffee and for now let's just have straight straight to the ship hey captain i'm here let's go there are people here looks like everyone is so scared uh, let's just go now and head straight to a different unknown land so we are in torin looks like war is all over the place you guys and now we're sailing towards a new land a promised land called across the great sea called the free lands <laughs> can't wait all right we are here how's the trip everyone okay okay looks like everyone is uh, settling in let's just head straight to the land and say hi to the town folks if there are any oh hey look at this there is a cooking pot we could open this oh we have uh, an apple uh, a goat cheese all right oh we could actually oh this reminds me of uh, i forgot breath of the wild we can cook this is fun ah i love this game already so we can bake apples bake more apples so now we have two so it will increase the satisfaction and maybe the heal its healing properties i'm just assuming by the way all right hey sir how you doing i just came from another land so we have a new quest here a strange delivery the man beckons you and though you've never met murmurs your name hmm okay this is weird he knows her name okay welcome to the free lands he says with a crooked tooth grin <laughs> this is uh, suspicious man this is sus someone's been waiting for you almost as though they foresaw your arrival i know not who he is he gestures towards the steed ride west bring this horse to the stranger the road will take you where you need to be oh thank you sir what that's so kind of you you're giving your horse all right oh let me pet the horse oh if you pet the horse it will add like a, a relationship level with the horse nice this is perfect all right we are now on our way we are now immersively riding the horse towards west and there's also a doe there ah oh, this is cool man bad reg presents ah wow okay this is this is cool this is good it's like an rpg triple a rpg in a different in a different dimension 
I like it. I love it. Oh, suddenly it become it's become gloomy. It's nighttime. Charted by you. <laughs> this is cool. All right. And uh, look at that. I, I, I love games that has fogs in it, especially this. And welcome to Mirthwood. I love the name also. Well, if you ask me, the only thing that I, I don't like is, again, I'm not a fan of this uh, art style, but I am learning to love it now. Yes, uh, it just brings things to life. It's very immersive and it's just so pretty. It's so beautiful. Hey, oh, there is a hooded stranger without a face. You're like a death reaper. Welcome, weary traveler. The stranger lifts his head eyes shadowed beneath his hood your journey has been long and i imagine you are full of questions first you must rest for you have carried the way of many miles ah oh, they're so you're so concerned you're like concerned ape <laughs> you're a concerned hooded person this land it belonged to someone i once knew take care of it you'll find that some things make more sense in time ah this is the mystery part i for now watch listen and settle in we'll likely cross paths again until then keep your eyes open you carry a lock few can claim oh you took my horse i thought it's my okay see you thank you sir this is so fresh in the eyes guys because this is although we're playing a farming game it's totally different it has mystery it has action suspense trailer you're what it's like you're in a movie uh it's 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 really good it's really good so we need to rest uh let's explore first if we can uh we can't do anything really because they we cannot go to this side here i think they blocked it okay let's just get some rest all right good morning so um let's see uh at the left upper left uh we can we need to gather 30 stone wood oh this is the best part uh the road to Br bright took bright oak we've given you a chest with a few items to jumpstart your demo experience okay this is the chest all right ah uh, we have here um Oh, all the tools. Awesome. But uh, this one, uh, we don't need. We don't need a sword now. We need to get all the tools. Oh, this is so organic. It looks so organic, man. Watering pot. We also have onion seeds. Aha. It's going to be fun. Uh, malted grains, flour, and uh, animal fat. Mm. I don't think we need all these uh, uh, military equipments for now. Let me just wear my usual clothes for farming. I, I don't think we need uh, the health elixir. Uh, let's just keep this family heirloom safe all right look at this we have a, a workbench so use the workbench to craft items for your farm from the workbench you can uh, craft station structures decor and storage containers use tab or i to access okay ah okay there you go so uh yeah we need to gather 30 stones you guys 30 stones let's go aha uh -huh, there you go this is the animation of when you want to pick up stones all right this is how it looks like only we only need to hit twice and then we should be able to mine or get the stone aha uh -huh, nice looks like our pickaxe is very effective it's no matter how huge the stone is uh, let me see let's check this is a huge stone let's see if we could no we can't maybe we need to upgrade our pickaxe but this one should be piece of cake oh i forgot don't forget guys if you play the demo or the game uh press shift so you can run and if you look at the lower left uh there is a uh, health stamina and uh the third uh hunger because again uh, this game has survival elements to it yeah uh, i'm so excited man i'm so happy about this okay let's run it seems that if i sprint the stamina is not lowering down maybe it will when the game comes out it's just for dem demo purposes i think okay finally we've gathered all of 30 stone now let's gather uh wood let's see if we could get this big wood nope we can't aha there you go only the small tiny woods we could we could gather okay we uh let's go cut more wood i have leveled up trades level one reach so let's press k ah uh, here you go so it seems that the more you yeah the more you do things the more it levels up so as you can see uh when you are cutting wood and those kind of things it will level up the trade and so on with the other skills okay let's see the map you guys look at this we i think we are here at this left middle side and uh man the map is huge considering that it's only a demo wow look at this we can do a lot of things here and discover mysterious things, secrets, and those kind of stuff. Meet new people. Ah, can't wait. Okay, we can actually hold left click. 
instead of mashing it it will just automatically use the use the tool when we hold left click and now we need to craft a cooking pot for the survival element yeah <laughs> oh look at this oh there is a beehive here can i zoom in zoom out no we can't Ah, oh, we get the honey from the beehive and now we're gonna craft a cooking pot pot which requires 15 stone and 10 wood aha there you go there you go guys so how could we uh how could we uh deploy this how oh we've upgraded our renown look at the right side plus five renown what happened we have a renown which means reputation i think how people see us uh in the far distance the faint but distant sound of life beckons a busting uh okay okay oh okay now that you've cleared some room, let's see how fertile this soil is. With tools in hand and seeds at the at the ready, it's time to turn these once forgotten grounds into thriving garden. Plant your crops and nurture them as they grow. So too will your connections to this land. Aha! This is fun. We can now craft cabbage, barley, and onion. How do we do that? Uh, a hoe. I need a hoe. Okay. Hoe. Ah, excuse me, guys. So. <laughs> Uh, let me just clear this stone here if we could ah uh, okay excuse me mr stone you're on the way a scythe let's clear uh let's clear the let's see how it works there you go it just got the weeds without any problem nice nice really good i love it so where am i gonna put our oh i'm gonna put it here Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, we can also repair our home. Look at that, you guys. Repair exterior, repair interior. So we need to gather all these materials. Man, there's a lot of things we could do here. I'm so excited. So excited here. I'm so excited for this game. So now we are hungry. Hunger and cooking. You are getting hungry. Refill your stomach by eating foraged herbs or foods. Cooked foods will provide a much greater benefit to you. Combined ingredients at cooking stations. You discover on uh, your travels failure to keep your tummy full may result in your character passing out oh oh okay uh, let's see i i have i do have baked apples here aha there you go good thing baked apples filled us up to almost 80 percent so now let's go ahead and clear this part here i want to plant the seeds now i'm so excited about this awesome so we have now a clear patch of land uh time to till the soil with a hoe let's see how it works uh uh there you go oh okay ah there's a mark we could till it if it's like uh like this all right it's it has an indicator okay ah awesome so there's some there it requires some space for it to be tilted which is nice oh it looks like there's some crawls we might need to uh build uh what to call this build a scarecrow for now let's just plant this onion seeds look at this this looks so good look at this every time i plant the seed i feel happy because i know that i'm gonna be harvesting them soon uh we also have cabbage okay man i messed this up I thought I have, uh, I only have, I thought I have nine <laughs> seeds, but I don't. Anyway, let's just continue making beds for these lovely plants or seeds. And I can see the soundtrack is so relaxing, you guys. It makes me want to fall asleep and wake up with a smile on my face. Okay, we have uh, barley seeds. Do we have more seeds here? I wonder what happened to father and I think he's my, he was my brother. <laughs> I wonder what happened and hopefully they're doing fine. Uh, I am here planting seeds, but I, I couldn't help but think about them. Hopefully they're doing fine. Uh, Lord Jesus, please keep them safe. Oh man, in a way we have to move forward and uh, uh, be the best that we can be in all circumstances. And for now, let's go ahead and water these lovely plants. This is the best way I can do for my family by being productive and being uh, trying to be happy. Although I'm kind of sad because I, I, again I'm worried about my mom, father, and my brother. Where could have, where, what could have happened to them? Hopefully they're doing fine. Someday I will return to them and I will uh, I will learn about their faith. Hopefully they are okay at the moment. Let's go ahead and uh, oh man, this is perfect. Uh, let's go ahead and can I do it here inside? Yeah, we can. Look at this. We could cook here. Mm. All right, there you go. Just beside our bed. Perfect. And now again, we feel hungry. It seems that we need to uh, get some rest. Could we? Nope, we cannot. Well, what do we have here? Uh, just beside uh, the, the, the bars, uh, there's a B for build, uh, rotate, refund, toggle grid. There's a grid here. G, 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 G. No, not working. By the way, guys, just a quick reminder. It, this is only a demo, although it looks great already. But again, it's a demo only. Oh, who, who is this guy here? 
Hey, hey, how you doing? Uh, hello. Are you okay? Uh, let's talk. Oh, cool. Strike a, a conversation. <laughs> Man, this should be all social sims should have this. They should have this kind of choices, man. So let's chat. Uh, small talk. So, so yeah, small talk first. Because we just knew each other. Oh, he's angry. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, it's like, it, this is like sims. <laughs> this is like the sims, man. Uh, may, uh, intellectual? No. Leisure, maybe? Ah, oh, he likes. Okay. He likes it. Uh, now we are very sleepy and uh, we need uh, food and uh, we're gonna faint. Uh, hold on. Hold on, please. I think I have a uh, go. Oh, I have this honey. Yum, yum. Eh, did not work. How about goat cheese? Ah, there you go. All right. See you. Wait, let me just uh, do one thing. Jester. Ah, ah, Jester. <laughs> Okay, I'm sorry. Hello. All right, see you. Keep safe. Gesture means making silly faces. And also, guys, while we are waiting for our uh, seeds to grow, uh, we might need to gather some uh, wood and materials to uh, fix our house. That's going to be fun, right? So if you look at the upper right-hand corner, the demo is only up to three days. So we'll make the best out of it. And look at this, our farms. They're so tiny and so pretty. So cute. I want to cuddle all of them. Hello, good morning. Are you thirsty, little plants? Uh, little sproutlings, let me just give you some uh, refreshing water. You're doing great, all of you. Grow well so I could eat you <laughs> and nourish my body. And uh, so I could use that nourishment and energy to be to help other people, to be patient and kind. That's how it works, I think, at least. That's what I know for now. So, okay, uh, let's see. Let's try and fix maybe the house. So we need to uh, repair... Uh... No, I want to repair our interior first. Wood and a stone. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Wood, not that. It's too big, this one. Let's get more wood. Uh, I think we need uh, around... 50 wood and stone as well and the thing is that uh man uh, the, the hunger meter is going down so fast maybe because we are working our our arms too much because we're building and uh we're only alone we're planting seeds and no one is here to help us so uh we are getting so hungry very fast the problem is it says we're gonna faint and who's gonna help us if we're gonna faint i think we'll just be lucky if we wake up the next day i do have here uh oh oh man honeyed up i could have used the honey to to craft this man i should have checked the cooking pot first you guys check your cooking pot what you could do right so you won't make the same mistake as i did now i'm so hungry uh, i have nothing to eat i think i'm gonna faint i don't know what's gonna happen to me oh we still have more apples nice aha uh -huh, i did not notice it oh man i'm so happy about this i have more apples all righty you guys we must did we just eat some apples here so now we've upgraded our uh, trades and also our survival because we cooked <laughs> nice nice but for now let's keep on gathering uh wood to fix our house so we need now four more wood and this should do it and now time to hit those these stones this is the second one more stones please and also what i'm really excited about the game is aside from the combat it also it also has a full-fledged story that i can't wait to to the uncover and finally you guys we can now repair interior or exterior it should be interior you right there you go let's all right you guys my apologies this part or last part has been corrupted hope you enjoy the videos that <laughs> was available and you can also look at the lower part for more videos and don't forget me with patience and kindness because this is what love is please don't forget to like and subscribe to help me grow I appreciate that much you do have a wonderful day goodbye